The My Normal is about highlighting LGBTI plus issues, showing that we exist and also empowering young people in the community. And it's so happy, it's so friendly. It really heartens me to see events like this happening. It's just, it's just wonderful. The My Normal Takeover is grabbing this museum and appropriating it for the uh, LGBTQ community. It's a night where we give over the reins of the museum and genuinely create a buzz around positive LGBT experiences. A lot of us, myself included, feel quite isolated when it comes to being young and LGBT, so it's very good for something to have to make friends. I met her. <laughs> she has to deal with me now. <laughs> This project has a massive potential to impact not just the LGBT community by giving it more safe spaces, more things happening for them for all ages. I think it's really about you know people who don't know much about LGBT history because they aren't in that community and that can have a massive impact. Here we are, young people asking questions that perhaps I, I didn't even know how to ask before. It's really nice to see events like this happening in museums like the Pitt Rivers because we get to look back at queer history. Queer histories have been so often overlooked in the past. I think it's a space to kind of celebrate and commemorate and reflect on those who've gone before us, be that through performance, be that through activism, be that through kind of community work, be that through history. Bridging that gap between history and the modern day. Really being truthful about what existed and making sure we're not forgetting that. I think that what's really exciting about this project is the way the museum's really partnering with LGBTQ communities to really make meaningful decisions about the museum's future, what it collects, the way that it tells its stories, the kind of people whose voices get heard within this space. It allows people to see others like them, as well as to see the, the very interesting kinds of art that members of the community are creating. We are no different from any other people outside the LGBTQ um, society and I really quite like that. Through the process of this project we are hoping to be far more engaged and embedded with our local community and much more active in how we partner with groups around us. Empowerment, just let them know that you're welcome, you're accepted and you're wanted here. It's really exciting that they're doing that, they are massive allies to the community to be doing it and hopefully it'll inspire more museums to do the same.